my waypoint right just puts me like right, now right there, Ontario the Freeway. The switch to IR is still quite a lot of heat. There's a pretty good shot of the uh, the incident. You can see that it's uh, almost uh, to the the road system. Uh, 15, in, 15 in the hours. City. We're over the uh, oil spill off of Huntington Beach in Orange County, and uh, the sun is starting to set. We count 16 cars in here. There may be more uh, underneath. You can see there's a, an increase of activity there with lots of ember uh, showers. Uh, the majority of the activity is further south of here. As we roll out this virus capability, our partnership with CAL FIRE will be essential in our ability to extinguish wildfires rapidly, uh, but as well, all other hazards that we see in the state of California. Uh, its ability to keep firefighters safe, to rapidly identify fire spread, uh, to be able to protect lives and property, and deploy resources will be essential in our ability to effectively respond to events that are impacting the state. And this is yet a part of a suite of a number of improvements in technology that we are doing here at Cal OES in partnership with Cal Fire and our local governments uh, to ensure that we have the most robust uh, mutual aid system and, our, and the most robust capability to respond to the all hazard events that California faces. This collaborative effort between Cal OES uh, and Cal Fire brings this asset into the uh, state mutual aid system and allows it to be more uh, readily available between the two agencies to send it north, south, east, or west. I believe by you know, Orange County Fire Authority taking a proof of concept, developing that to a point for it to be a legitimate um, and valuable state program and handing it off to Cal OES, who is, let's face it, the state's all-hazard um, agency, just makes great sense.